question 231 x into 4y dx plus 2x dy plus y cube into 3y dx plus 5x dy equal to 0 the given differential equation is in the form x raised to alpha into y raised to beta by m y dx plus n x dy plus x raised to alpha dash into y raised to beta dash into m dash y dx plus n dash x dy equal to 0. So for such question we can apply rule 6 to find the integrating factor uh, integrating factor and integrating factor will be of the form x raised to h into y raised to k so before doing that we have to first check whether the differential equation is exact or not so i am going to assume it is not exact and going to and going to find the integrating factor so in exam you should first check whether the differential equation is exact or not so if it is uh, if if x raised to h into y raised to k is the integrating factor for this differential equation if you multiply it throughout with this differential equation you you will get an exact equation which satisfies the property dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x so i am going to use the this property of exact equation to find h and k so we will just first multiply this differential equation throughout with x raised to a h into y raised to k so multiplying with integrating factor and rearranging so we will rearrange this to into a form m dx plus n dy so we get 4 x y so first dx term is 4 x y so 4 into x raised to h plus 1 into y raised to k plus 1 second dx term is um, this 3 y raised to 4 so 3 x raised to h into y raised to k plus 4 dx plus so dy terms first term 2x square dy so 2 into h plus 2 into y raised to k plus so second dy term is 5xy cube so 5x raised to h plus 1 into y cube so k plus 3 dy equal to 0 let me just okay so this is our equation now we will uh, where our m is this and n is this we are, so we are going to find dou m by dou y first to use this property so which gives 4 into k plus 1 into x raised to h plus 1 into y raised to k plus uh, 3 into k plus 4 into x raised to h y raised to k plus 3 similarly dou n by dou x is equal to 2 into h plus 2 into x raised to h plus 1 into y raised to k plus um, second term so 5 into k plus 3 sorry h plus 1 y into h plus 1 into x raised to h into y raised to k plus 3 so now since uh, we are going uh, since this equation is exact we know that dm dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x now comparing the coefficients we have uh, so 2 and 2 cancel so we have 2k plus 2 equal to h plus 2 this is our first equation and here it becomes 3k plus 12 is equal to 5h plus 5 so this is this is, we can write h minus 2k 2 minus 2 is 0 h minus 2k is equal to 0 similarly is right right 
okay similarly we have second equation is y h minus uh, 3k y minus 12 so which is 7 so minus 7 right equal to 0 so you can apply h equal to 2k into this equation to solve this h and k so h equal to 2k putting h equal to 2k we have 10k so i'll just so to avoid confusion we have 5 into h equal to 2k so 5 into 2k minus 3k equal to 7 so which implies 10k minus 3k 7k equal to 7 that implies k equal to 1 and h equal to 2 into k which is 2 so we got our k equal to 1 and h equal to 2 therefore our integrating factor is x raised to h into y raised to k so x square into y raised to k is 1 so x square y is our integrating factor we are going to um, apply the value of h and k in this equation so, in this equation okay So let me copy this into a new page. This is our equation. So we will apply h equal to h is equal to 1 and k equal to sorry h equal to 2 and k equal to 1 h equal to 2 k equal to 1 right from our previous steps we got h equal to 1 h equal to 2 and k equal to 1 so we are going to apply the values in this equation to get our exact equation so we get 4 into x raised to x cube y cube so 2 plus 1 is 3 so one sorry y square k plus 1 is 1 plus 1 2 so x cube y square plus 3 into x square y into y raised to 5 dx plus 2 into x raised to 4 into y y raised to 1 raised to 1 plus 5 into x raised to x cube into y raised to 4 dy equal to 0 this is exact equation since we found out the values of h and k using the property of an exact equation this will be exact you can check if you want so since we know that this is an exact equation we can apply the solution for exact equation which is solution is integral m dx with y as a constant plus integral terms in n without x dy equal to a constant so inte integrating we have integral 4 x cube y square plus 3 x square y raised to 5 into dx plus if you look at the n term every uh, n has two terms so each term has x in it so this vanishes so is equal to c so if you integrate we have uh, with y as a constant we, x raised to 4 by 4 and this 4 cancels so x raised to 4 into y square plus so x cube by 3 and 3 cancels so x cube y raised to 5 equal to c again there is 
one is to let me just k equal to one so y is y square this part will be y raised to k plus one right let me just check the previous step four plus y so four x raised to h plus one and y raised to k plus plus three y raised to four which is three x raised to h into y raised to k plus four so this part is correct only so okay so this is the solution so anyway in this textbook the answer given is x raised to four cube plus x cube y raised to five so the power here of the y is given as y cube so i am assuming it's a printing mistake and this is the right answer because all the other part remains same so a lot of printing mistake in the test or am i missing any steps so if you find if you find any steps if i uh, wrong or if you find i made some mistake do point out i will just correct correct it in the video anyway this is these are the steps we used to rule 6 to find our integrating factor we applied the integrating factor and found out our solution this is the solution so this is the solution to question number 231